Okay, so I'm curious to talk about as a, a novice, as someone just getting to meditation, what does TM, uh, how did you describe it in your book, and how does it equate to like success? Well, I, I can't claim that this is TM, Transcendental Meditation. It's inspired by many forms of meditation, mostly TM, I would say. Uh, it's mantra-based, and, and I think everybody needs to, to sit, let their thoughts settle. Very important. I mean, in, in the first instance, you take inventory and you make decisions without too much emotion. And in the second instance, as the mind settles, you become happier and more insightful. And your nervous system gets stronger and your immune system gets stronger. And your brain, you can see on a scanner, becomes more expansive, the gray matter in the brain. And the thing that at eight years old, your brain starts to separate the left side and the right side. You break, you break that wall down. It's very important to connect these two functions in the brain. And you have a other thing that when you're uncomfortable, you excrete toxins into your body. And that's just a natural reaction. But if you are a meditator, you don't do it so often. There's a tremendous difference in your personal well-being to have this, this shift. So people live longer and are happier simply by meditating. And, and there's nothing else people really want but happiness. They say they want other things, but the things uh, to do what? Make you happy. So it's funny. You know, people who want money and success and worldly things, I mean, those things don't make you happy. Money doesn't make you happy. But happy makes you money. If you're an attractive, good giver, you're a good giver, you become a great getter. Meditation helps you become less needy and more of a giver. Do your work more without the noise and the worry of expectation. So meditation has many, many different benefits. I meditate with my kids every morning. I think everybody should meditate with their kids. I think every school should offer meditation. We now, through the David Lynch Foundation, we have hundreds of thousands of kids meditating. And I think it's important that we keep up that messaging whether it's through Oprah, who we, David Lynch and Matt Foundation helped her to learn to meditate, or through Ellen DeGeneres, who David Lynch Foundation and my work helped her to meditate. These people, they have big mouths. It's good to have them talking about meditation. It's good to incorporate it in most people's lives. Anyone who meditates benefits from it. I guess that leads perfect to my next question. Is what, is, what was your purpose for writing this book? I wrote the book as a gift. You know, I mean, I give away the money that I get from the book. And I wrote the book because it's important. I, I, I've had experiences where I've written books and people tell me my books have helped to change their lives. And um, that's what it's about. That's why you're here. You know, so there's nothing better than that. You know, change someone's life for the better. And um, I want to touch on the comfortable seat aspect that you, you touched on during the discussion here. I was really fascinated. <clears throat> this idea of stillness. The basketball player, when he's in a zone, he's, he's still, even though he's moving, moving stillness. Can't miss. A rim as big as an ocean. The kind of a high you get. You've been there. Been the car accident, everything moved really slow. You've been in positions where you've read and stopped breathing because you're reading that words and you're so engaged. This kind of concentration, this is what you want. This is why you meditate, to have this kind of concentration. And that's, and that's why I want to give people a gift so they can concentrate, so they can get in the zone more often, so they can be awakened and see beauty more often, and so they can do a good job and be focused and do a good job more often than not. So it's important to give this gift because it's been for thousands of years a tool that is utilized to change people's lives, to uplift people, to make them happier and more successful. So here's this tool, many thousands of years old, and we're not using it. I want every school and every person to have it. 